Good morning, dolls. This is just a quick unboxing. But yeah, sorry, I already unboxed it. I couldn't wait. But I do want to show you what I got today. Okay, so these items I ordered um, out of a lot off of eBay. Now, I just wanted to show you just what's possible when you go online. You can find some really great secondhand pieces. Now, these are two beautiful armchairs that came in my bundle. They're really finely finished. Um, that one looks like it might have a little glue on the on the side there, but no worries. I can clean that up. But look how finely um, finished those uh, the wood is and how lovely the upholstery is. This is a really, really nice piece. And pieces like this, if they were sold individually, they would be a lot more than what I paid for them as a bundle. Um, when I see miniatures that have really fine, smooth finishing, really delicate, um, delicately finished wood, to me, those remind me of more like museum grade pieces. Now, these are the side chairs Oops, that go to um, that set. You can see the wood very, very fine, very neatly detailed, just beautiful finishes on these pieces. I'm really, really grateful to have found um, some pieces this nice in a bundle. Now, they're not marked like um, as Best Pack or Fantastic Finishers, but to me, like I said, they look higher end because they're um, just finished so nicely. Now, another driver to me purchasing this lot is this little table. Again, it's not marked, but look how beautiful that wood is. That looks like a life-size piece, and that has a little stain on it. But no worries, it'll probably have a vase on it or a lamp when I finish. But look, it's finished on the back. Look at the detailing on that and the beautiful grains of wood. To me, like I said, that looks as beautiful as a life-size piece. And if you were buying pieces that were antique or secondhand um, and life-size, they may have some scars or scuffs on them as well. Now, this is, I'll show you the accessories last. So this was a dining room table that was in the bundle. I love that carving on the legs, really beautifully finished. Now, I do already have a dining room table for the rooming house, dollhouse. But yeah, I might actually swap that out because I think this is really pretty. Very nicely finished. Very, very beautiful. Look how thin the legs are. And to me, those are marks that it's a really higher end piece. Now, this was another driver to me purchasing this particular lot. Um, very nicely finished. The sideboard, look at the delicate wood, the finishing on the edges. The wood is just smooth and so pretty, beautifully detailed. All the drawers open. The legs are really done really, really nice. Like I said, I really, really am pleased with these pieces finish really nice all the way around the back and look at that wood grain just really really um really really nice and I guess I keep saying really really nice for the price that I got it I definitely wouldn't have gotten all these pieces individually for that amount so I'm really pleased now one of the little handles fell off no worries like I said if it was a life-size piece you may have to do some repairs to it but it was definitely worth it now, in the bundles, you still get some kind of little random, uh, more common pieces, but no worries. I definitely can use that as well. This was just a little common uh, clock, and it's it's nice. It can be used in, in a setting because you're always going to need little accessories around. also had a little bathroom sink. I definitely will be able to use that. Needs a little work on it, but it'll come in handy. I definitely can use it. A little modification. All right, and this was cute. I thought it was really adorable. A little dollhouse for the dollhouse. It's made out of some kind of like little paper and veneer. Needs a little work on it, but I can work. I can fix it up. It'll look cute in the children's room. Now, this was another piece. It looks like it may have been from the Krizenbahn uh, collection, just based on the color of that plastic, you know. And I'll, I, I can doctor it up a little bit and use it. It's just a medicine cabinet. But I definitely believe I'll be able to use it um, in the bathroom, in the Roman house, dollhouse. house. I think it'll come in handy. I definitely think it will. It's a, it's a nice piece. Now, this was um, 
a little light. It was a, actually had a cord on it. So it was actually electrified light. I don't have or use electrified lights in my doll houses. I have battery LED lights, but this is a sconce and it's cute. So I think it'll come in handy. I can maybe put it in one of those back hallways. So I'll be able to use everything that I got. But this was to me just one of the major pieces. I thought this was just magnificent. It's a little tea set, silver tea set. And I really like it because it's not like that bright chrome that a lot of um, silver tea sets have that you see um, for purchase nowadays. It kind of is like, uh, has an antique finish. Very, very, very nice. Has a very uh, antique, even shade of the metal. I love it. But the detail on it to me is just incredible. That's the little creamer. And this just did it for me. The little sugar bowl and the lid came off. I was done. Had to have it. Had to have it. I'm very pleased with this. And look at the detailing on that tray. It's hammered. Look at the handles. I mean, that just to me really stood out. When you see pieces that have this much detailing, that's what I'm looking for. Pieces that have a lot of realism and that have the finishes on them as if it was a life-size piece. Yeah, it's got the hammered effect. I love that. I'm really, really pleased with that. Now, I did have a couple other little random pieces in there, as I mentioned. You'll get the nicer, higher-end pieces, but this was like a, a toilet box. So I'll use that for something. And then a little random um, axe. You can always use an axe in a house. And a little um, gardening tool. And then another little piece that's sort of like some kind of implement. You know, you know you're going to need accessories for all kind of stuff. It could even maybe end up in a junk drawer. And then these were a little small bag of some other, it looks like little faucet pieces that may have gone to that bathroom collection, a little chain in there. So I'll save that. You never know what you might need for another project down the line. So you save everything. You don't throw anything away. Don't throw anything away. So I definitely will be able to use that later on in another project. So I'm really, really, really happy with this bundle. I'm really I uh, feel fortunate to have found something this nice on eBay, but I want to encourage you to not be afraid or shy away from secondhand or bundles you find on eBay. You know, look at the description, read the details, look at the pictures really close and just determine if it's a, you know, if it's a, a bargain and you can find some really great pieces for your projects or your doll houses. Okay, so I definitely uh, just wanted to share with you the, the unboxing that I already unboxed. Just wanted to show you what I got today. Um, definitely, if you haven't already checked out the other videos regarding the Roman House Dow House, look, check those out and make sure you let me know if you enjoyed this video today. Let me know in the comments, like, share, and subscribe, and also hit the notification bell so you'll know when I'm uploading more video regarding the rooming house doll house or maybe even another haul thanks so much for watching dolls bye bye now